कलर ब्राइंडनेस और पार्शियल ब्राइटनिंग डिफिशियंस आई एम डॉक्टर गोयल फ्रॉम संजीवन फॉर परफेक्ट आई सेट मुंबई टूडेज टॉपिक इज कलर ब्राइंडनेस to cover this topic in a very good fashion in very good way we can divide this topic in what are the definition of color blindness what are the types of color blindness what are the causes of color blindness what are the signs and symptoms of color blindness what are the carriers affected by this problem of color blindness what are the diagnosis of color blindness or how we diagnose the color blindness and treatment of the color blindness so we can cover this topic in a very definition of color blindness is inability to differentiate between colors or we can say certain colors or in all colors is called as color blindness means if we have problem in identifying mostly red and green or between two colors or two shades or two color of two shades it comes under color blindness color blindness say is maybe not the correct word partial red vision deficiency or color vision deficiency is the right word generally in short is called as cvd color vision deficiency what are the types of color blindness a normal person who is having a normal color vision they are called as triatops Trinotops or they have it. They are they are they are using all three types of cones. They are called as trinotops, where they are using all the cones, red, green, and blue, trinotomy. If they are dominantly red deficient, it is called as protons. If dominantly green deficient, called as dutans. if they are deficient in blue or yellow color mainly blue is tetrahedral tetons so color blindness is two type either red green deficiency or blue yellow deficiency commonly red green deficiency which i said either they are maybe uh, proton deficient or dutan deficient proton deficient where the dominantly red is more deficient than the green color combined they are called as red green deficient they are comes under the form of protons when the green is more dominantly deficient combined they are called as red green deficient they are called as dutans protons and dutans they can be strong mild or medium strongly deficient mediumly deficient and mildly deficient second is blue yellow deficiency blue yellow deficiency is only when the organic problems are there and the problems are there with the disease eye is generally happens in that's called as uh, blue yellow deficiency trichotomy there are the types of color blindness if sugar there is no colors being seen by the person is called achromatopsia which happens in so many problems like when the person can see black and white now this is the types of color blindness so now we comes on the causes of color blindness causes mostly it is inherited it is a x linked chromosome problem generally inherited from the mother or from the parents so it is hereditary second it can be acquired also acquired when the certain terms and certain conditions are there in the body and eyes that can give to color blindness for example chronic illness like in diabetes mellitus glaucoma optic neuritis macular degeneration retinitis pigmentosa liver diseases like chronic alcoholism etc 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 we can give rise to color blindness accidentally 
when any accident is there in the accident if any part of brain eye and nerve optic nerve is damaged or get affected which is responsible for color vision detection or color detection that can give rise to color blindness certain medicines certain medicines are there like barbiturates anti tubercular medicines certain antibiotics etc etc certain medicines are there which can give to color blindness next industrial or environmental like carbon monoxide carbon disulfide they can give rise to the color blindness next age it has been seen the people who are senior citizens more than 60 65 they start getting little little deficiency of colors mostly been seen after 70 75 years of age so that all thing comes in acquired form so there are so many certain conditions are there which can lead to color blindness but generally when we talk about color vision deficiency cvd partial vision deficiency or color blindness means inherited congenital the people who has completely normal eye structurally but functionally in color vision they get problem due to axillary chromosome problem we talk about that and that we mean color vision deficiency or color blindness now we come to the sign and symptom of color blindness in sign and symptoms mostly we see they have problem in distinguishing shades of colors they find difficulty in identifying traffic signals as we know the pattern of traffic signal is this green yellow and red so they can take care by the work but generally been seen they get problem in uh, differentiating the shades in the colors in practical life when they go and match shades of clothes they get in problem when they go and buy fruits they can be in problem suppose he is buying tomatoes and he want to buy red tomatoes he is a color blind he can bring green along with red tomatoes so when they buy vegetables they can face the problem so it is practically been seen wherever the color differences are there in the practical life they face a lot of difficulty we see lot many artists are color blind they face lot of difficulty when they are painting or when they are coloring uh, the their art in color industries when they match the colors when they make paint paint industries where they make different shades of the paint paints they get lot of problems like in every field collusion creates problem if it is there in defense in police in merchant navy and the captain is standing on the deck he sees the signal coming out from far distance of the sea he should see is the green color or red color so he can decide about the he can take the decision about taking the ship on that side or not to take on that side pilots aviation that has a very good important role of color vision in the cockpit there are so many small small buttons are there with different different colors and even yes when he is flying he has to take decision in the cockpit for so many works i met one person who was exporting tomatoes he said i am always in lost when i export tomatoes my other colleagues who are doing this business they are making good profit problem was what he was color blind when he was buying crops that time he supposed to export green tomatoes but due to his color blindness he was ignoring the red tomatoes also in that so when the red tomatoes used to go with green tomatoes the all consignment used to destroy when they they used to reach to destination i went to web designer when they have the web design they have a lot of problems in doing their work so practice there most of the signs symptoms are there where there is the differentiation of colors i met once a person who is serving in the restaurant 
because green and red symbols are there on the packets. If somebody is vegetarian and if by mistake he serves the non vegetarian packet, then they are problem. So these are the mainly sign symptoms are those where the color differentiation is there, they find a lot of difficulty there. Now we come to the carriers affected by color blindness. As I was mentioning just now, the people who are working in defense require too much of color vision clearance, police, aviation, merchant navy, navy or shipping, I should say, is a navy or merchant navy. Aviation means air force and commercial pilots. Banks, because banks has all different different colors on the different different notes, they have separate colors. And hospitality, like in the hotel industry, chef should know the difference of the color. We've got all vegetables and dishes have the different colors. Even the waiters, as I said just now, they should know this. Uh, they should be color with clear because they can make mistakes in serving. So there are so many professions are there. Like I was saying in uh, web designing, when they are uh, doing that work, they should know the difference, the shapes of colors. Artists, when they should know what the color should be. Like he is painting certain things. He knows what color he wants to paint, but he can't paint because he doesn't know the difference between the colors. So mostly, the all fields, all professions, they need color. Now diagnosis. These were the symptoms we said they face difficulty in shades identification. But as we want to diagnose them, they are proton or duton or they are strong proton or strong duton or medium proton or medium duton or mild proton or mild duton. How to diagnose that? There are plenty of tests that are available to diagnose color vision deficiency. For example, namely. Isiara test, Frasler D15 test, Edith Green test, Edith Green 19 test, Frasler 19 test or double neck tendency test, Anamanoscope, CAT test, color assessment diagnosis. This is the ultimate test which diagnoses the color vision deficiency. In Sanjeevan Go Perfect Eyesight, Mumbai, we have all the tests available, whatever being used in the world to diagnose color vision deficiency, whatever name I have said just now, all are available here in Sanjeevan for perfect eyesight. Ishara test, transfer T15 test, Edith Green Lantern test, transfer Lantern test, Anamaloscope, CAT test. There is a hundred new tests also is there, which is also available here. CT test, they are all are available. Because this is the pilot examination center too, and for the shipping people also. So we have all equipped with diagnosis of the patients. Now we come on the treatment part, which is very crucial point of the color blindness. There is no cure of this disease because it's an extreme chromosome problem, genetic problem. But treatment can be possible. Treatment in Sanjeevan for perfect eyesight been given from 2006 with plenty of success is available here by integrated and natural methods. There is no operation, no laser, no LASIK, no steroids, no antibiotics. They are all specific integrated methods which use so many parameters in that link. They use so many methods like vision therapy, like trichopensor, natural medicine supplement, etc. etc. They are called an integrated method. Means when we are using more than one therapy for one treatment and one disease treatment that is called integrated methods. Why they improve here? There are two process goes on in the body. Regeneration and rejuvenation. Regeneration is called when the cell divide. 2 to 4, 4 to 8, 8 to 16, 16 to 32. Like when anybody gets wound or hurt in the upper extremities or lower extremities of the body, the wound can heal up without medicine, without medical aid because the cell divide. But these cells, cone cells, 
they never divide i can explain in the retina the important most layer of the eye is retina that is a photosensitive layer anybody sitting in front of the person can make out through retina only that is two parts center and periphery center part is made up of is called as macula is made up of bones 6 to 7 million bones are there in macula 2 to 3 mm area the center part of the macula 0.2 to 0.3 mm is called as foveal centrics that has cones the cone like structure how they mimic cone like structure they are called as cone cells their function is day within fine within and color within there are 6 to 7 million cone cells are there in our foveal centrics there are so many theories about this that they say the colorblind people who are deficient they don't have color within cone cells or deficient right thing they are there in them structurally normal but functionally not normal due to actually chromosome problem so we rejuvenate these cone cells to clarify cone cells are three type long wavelength they identify red colors medium wavelength which identify green color short wavelength which identify blue colors as i said in beginning when anybody is using all these three type of cones called as trichromes try three all three type of cones so we rejuvenate these cone cells by our integrated method so their function is start improving and that is it they start improving the all color vision their test comes normal and when they identify what problem they are facing that goes up but maybe genetically they that may not go away from their genes but treatment wise can be treated and that can be maintained and then can be maintained the good vision and the color vision near about 4 to 8% of the male population is affected by this problem 0.4 to 0.5% in the female it is there mainly the male part is more affected so to summarize color blindness is a very important problem in the society that should be taken care of. and non invasive methods it can be treated in sanjeevan ko perfect as it may be this much i have to tell about color blindness today see you in the next video with other topics if anybody want to contact sanjeevan ko perfect as it they can contact on the the details given described below thank you You can contact on nine three two four two four zero seven zero two. You can visit our site www.sanjeevan.in, or you can contact us on or mail us on info at the rate sanjeevan.in.